Hello, my name is Leon and I'm from passionfordancing.com and today I wanted to give you a dance tip uh, that is going to be covering uh, isolation. So basically when you're doing uh, some kind of a Latin dance movement like a cucaracha step or uh, just a simple walk, um, you want to isolate different parts of the body. We don't move everything at once. I'll give you a quick example. So if you do the Cuban rock or side rock, if I'm gonna do it here, as you can see, I'm concentrating on moving my hips, but I'm not moving everything else at the same time, yes? If I did, it would look like this. See, now I'm moving my hips and my shoulders at the same direction, yes? So what I really wanna make sure is that I isolate the hip area from the upper body in this case. So it helps to bring the, the arms out so you have a nice frame. And then when I do my hip action, I'm just focusing on bringing my hip forward and around, forward and around, forward and around, forward and around. And I'm trying to do it against my arms and my shoulders, yes? And um, this is a mistake that we see a lot of people is they're trying to move everything together and then it doesn't look good, yes? So um, I'll give you another example. If I'm going to uh, just uh, walk forward and I'm going to do a rotation in the body, so what I do is I bring my hip forward and then I rotate around and then I do a step. And I rotate and I do a step. Yes? So, what you don't want to do, what you see a lot of times, is this. Yeah? And it starts looking empty. The reason is because there is no opposition. You need to isolate, again, different parts of the body. So again, in this case, the only thing that's really rotating is my hip, my leg, around my spine. But nothing else. Yes? So again, trying to keep the upper torso very still and rotate against it as much as you can, and then you can take a step. That is very, very important. Or on a figure like the crossover brakes, or New Yorkers it's also called. So if I'm gonna go forward here, versus, you see how everything turning at the same time uh, doesn't look good, it looks like um, it's out of control, and your partner is going to probably feel uh, re that you are really rough, yes? So practice isolating the different body parts and understand what each movement is about, which body part it's about. And good luck.